Hey, how are you doing? I thought I would pop on with a midweek, what did I get shopping wise? So happy Monday, it's Monday for me anyway. Um, and yeah, I've been to Aldi. I also went to the chemist warehouse and I did calls just for a couple of things that I couldn't get in Aldi. Do you know how you can't do like a full, full, full shop in Aldi if there's specific things you need? So I did pop the calls. The reason why I'm, I'm Aldiing is like, I think everyone's feeling the pinch at the minute, aren't they? And we're feeling the pinch, that's for sure. Um, so yeah, decided to go to Aldi for my shopping and I thought I'd show you what I got, basically. So from the chemist warehouse, I'll show you that first because obviously the Aldi is what you want to see. Um, I said I was going on a, just for a couple of weeks on the um, slim fast sort of like milkshake repl meal replacement diet for a little bit, just for a couple of weeks. Um, just to try and shed a couple of, well not a couple of kilos in a couple of weeks, but just to try and shed some weight, you know. Um, I know it sounds stupid, but I need to lose a little bit of weight before I go back to the gym. I know that sounds ridiculous, <laughs> but that's just how my brain works. But anyway, I found this for $35, which I thought was really good. I thought, I thought it would be way more. Um, for a banana flavoured Opti Slim milkshakes and you get uh, 21, you get 21 sachets in here for $35 which I thought was quite good. I'm not, I've got nothing to like compare it with but I thought that was quite good. So I'm going to replace like my breakfast and my lunch with one of these every day and then just have like a normal dinner and I also got myself for $6.99 I got this shaker for obviously for the milkshakes and then I picked up I hope these haven't melted they were in a hot car feels all right um these were so these are fat blaster snack bars choc caramel flavor and you get five in the pack and they were $8.99. So they were $8.99 for five, which I thought was okay. Not too bad. Oh, they were doing this for $4.99. Whenever I've got this, it's been from the supermarket and it's always been like eight or nine dollars, which is ridiculous. But this is my favorite. It's the Pearl and Beauty Nivea deodorant. So I was like, what? That's Fantastic, so I've got some of that. I got some Urex Itch Cream. This is because Elliot does like a um, fight club thing and he got a rash from it. I think someone has passed a rash onto him. It's awful, it's on the top of his, like it's on his thigh and it's like really lumpy bumpy. It gives me a bit of trypophobia, if you know what that is. Um, but yeah, I got this and this was 9 99 for a tub. So for a tube so I'm hoping that it helps him I got some of this I've been I need some um, foundation because I've run out this was only $4.99 it's the flower what is it oh no that's no that's different what is it then where is it oh there no sorry it was only $8.39 and it's L'Oreal, L'Oreal? No, it's not L'Oreal. I don't actually know who makes it, but it's Flower, Light Illusion, Luminous Makeup, All Day Wear, and it's in the shade Nude 13. I just thought that looked really good. I'm gonna try it, see what it's like. And then me LV um, Plumping Shampoo for $4.99, um, which I think is average, I don't know. Okay, moving on to, I'll quickly show you calls. Um, oh, that's just some multivitamins. Um, so calls are now doing um, their own range of cheaper items, which is a long time coming, in my opinion. They have needed to do that, I think. 
for a long time and it's only just starting to happen but these massive pack of tender straps kangaroo treats for dogs was only 5 90 for this big i was expecting it to be like 15 dollars for something this big uh 5 90 let's hope this continues and they have more of their own range of cheaper items because that would be great um then i got baxter some where is it some of this chicken it's like a, it was in the cold bit in the pet section and it's chicken and lentils with oh no sorry chicken with sweet potato green beans and barley and it'll he'll probably get like two or three meals out of it and it was only four dollars reduced from five which five's quite good isn't it really um so i'll try him with that and see what he thinks that'll have to go in the fridge and i got a weight watchers um mushroom pumpkin risotto and that was 390 i thought that was quite good i've had it before and it's actually really nice and then i got just some corn pieces and some corn mints absolutely ridiculous price seven dollars each seven dollars each i think they take the mick out of vegetarians i do i think it's like a if you're a vegetarian then you're gonna pay over the odds <laughs> right now moving on to aldi Me a receipt here so that I know how much things are because I might not remember. So I got these snacking banana chips mainly for Elliot because he's a growing lad, he's almost well, he's 16, he's going on 17, and he's growing at the rate of nuts and he's always eating. So banana chips, uh, $2.89 for those. Oh, I got a giant. <laughs> Thing of toilet rolls because, oh, well, you know. <laughs> and they were ten fifty nine for those. Then I got these apple and cinnamon bake bars again for Elliot and Stephen. Um, and these were they were three ninety nine for a pack of five, which I thought was all right. I'm not going to be eating them because they're probably full of carbs. Um, I also got these polar bars. They're like, um, can you remember chalk ices? But they're not really chalk ices because they've got like they've got like a, um, a soft biscuit around the outside of the ice cream. Not my type of thing, to be honest. I wouldn't really care for them. So they were three forty nine. They're for Elliot and Stephen. Then I got some bananas and they were, I don't know how much they were, I can't find them on the receipt. I know for a fact that I scanned them though. I think they were like $2.30 or something. Then I got some button mushrooms because they were cheaper than the already chopped and you just wash the mud off basically, wash it off and chop them up. And I love these for... Um, like dieting and getting protein in and eating healthy. I think they're a really good like sustenance sort of thing. So they were, they were 3 49 Then I got some kitchen roll cause spillages happen a lot, especially with having a teen in the house. He's quite clumsy to be honest. <laughs> He's very clumsy. Yeah, you come in and He's been cooking right, like he'll make eggs on his little cookie cooking devices that we got him for Christmas. And you'll come in and there'll be like egg everywhere. It'll be on the on the benches, on the floor, there'll be like eggshells on the floor, there'll be egg on the um fridge. Just you come in and you're like, what happened in here? <laughs> I'm sure he tries to be as careful as he can, but it's yeah. Anyway, so they were two ninety nine for a pack of three. 
Then we got two of these lemon lime bitters. Because we all like a bit of lemon lime bitter. And it's no added sugar, quite low, um, quite low sugar, if that makes sense. Um, and they were $2.10 each. $2.10 each? No, $2.10 for the two. There must have been $1.05 or something each. Um, so that's quite good. And then I got some teriyaki noodles for Elliot. They were only $1.99. It's quite a big tub, really, for $1.99. I thought that was quite good. Next bag. <laughs> it's quite a big shop, really. I didn't intend on getting so much. But um, I ended up getting quite a bit because we need it, you know. So um, Then I got some pasta spirals. I think they were only like $1 something. And then I got some... They call it tuna bake, creamy tuna bake, but I'm not going to put tuna in it. But I'm going to make Elliot like a pasta bake with cheese on top. I thought that would be nice. He likes stuff like that. Uh, the tuna bake was $2.99. Then I got a load of these protein yogurts because they were $1.99 each. Was it $1.99 each? I'm sure that, yeah, they were $1.99 each, so I got quite a few of the salted caramel flavour ones. The 15 grams of protein in each of them, I think that's quite good. And then there's mango and passion fruit, I got a few of them. And I also got a few of the strawberry ones as well. So I got loads of those. Everyone likes yoghurt in this house, so we're not going to go far wrong with lots of yoghurt. Then I got a vegetable and sweet potato and chickpea soup. That wasn't very expensive either. What? $8.97? says $8.97 on here. 430 grams of pouched soup. You've got to be kidding. $8.97? That's got to be a mistake. $8.97. Wait a minute. Is that because it's counted? No, because it would say three, wouldn't it? That can't be right. It can't be. So where's the other one? Because I got another one. Well, I got actually I got this is probably why it says pouched soup eight ninety seven, but it doesn't say three of them. Yes, it does. I was really panicking there. I thought they charged me eight dollars something for a soup, but it was eight ninety seven for three of them because there were two ninety nine each. So I got a curried cauliflower, two curried cauliflower. I thought that sounded really nice. Curried cauliflower. Never had that before. And I thought, yeah, I'm going to enjoy that. And obviously the vegetable and sweet potato chickpea as well. Then I got some mandarins. Are they mandarins or are they just mini oranges? Mini oranges. And the mini oranges were, I think they were 3 29 I can't really tell what it says. I hope it's not too dark. Make, it's making me look like I'm really sunburned, but I'm not. It's really dark. But anyway, I think that's what it says. Because um, it says in a tie bag, so that must be it. Um, 3 29 Then I got some sweet and crunchy baby carrots. I remember thinking these weren't very expensive. $1.39 for all of them. I thought that was really good. A lot of this stuff I was like surprised. Like I think the prices have come down a little bit. I think. Then I got a capsicum duo. And that was $4.99 for the two. That's actually quite expensive, isn't it? $4.99 for two capsicums. 
Then I got some, this was really expensive, but I wanted it for Elliot and Stephen. I thought they'd both enjoy that. Um, Milky Bar Hot Chocolate. That was actually 5 49 which is quite a lot, but you get 10. Is, is that a lot? I don't know. You get 10 in it, but I thought they would enjoy it, so. And what else? I got two of these meat free sausages for me and Elliot for when I do like casseroles and things. I could do like um, a sausage cas casserole with vegetables. I think that would be quite nice. So they were $4.99 each. It says $10 and I've nearly had a heart attack again. It's $10 because they were $4.99 each. That was $9.98 altogether for two of them. I don't know where the other one's gone. Oh, I've got another bag there. And then I got some red kidney beans. They were 95 cents for the tin, which I thought was quite good. Then we have some Thai handle um, garbage bags for the bin, obviously. I'm not gonna be sharing anything else other. <laughs> and they were 3.29 for 20. Then, is that bag done? Last bag. <laughs> so first of all I got some Harvest Snaps Sugar Snap Peas in just plain. I think it's, um, get me words out. I think it's Elliot that likes these. Um, he's mentioned them in the past. $5.49 for a big bag. I don't know if that's good or not. It's quite a big bag, but let me know if you think that's good or not. Okay, I got two of these, one for Elliot, one for Stephen. It's the Chocolate Fudge Honeycomb Corner um, yogurts. These are so nice, like so nice. I didn't get one for me though, because I'm obviously trying to be good. I've just found the bananas, they were $2.23. <laughs> whilst looking for something else. $7.96? Oh no, that's the salted caramel yogurts. Um, I don't know, I think these were one ninety nine each, the same as the others. And then I got some broccoli, just one um, stem, is that what you call it? A stem of broccoli? And that was one twenty eight. Oh, there's the other veggie sausages. Oh, this looks interesting. I've not seen them do these before. I think these are new. So it's an air fryer, Thai sweet chili and lime broccolini. How nice does that sound? So different. Like I've not seen that before. So that was $4.99. We'll probably get like a few, um, a few portions out of it, so. Yeah, it's washed and cut and you just season, season with the sachet. You get like a sachet inside and you just sprinkle it on and air fry it. Ready in six minutes. How interesting. So I thought that was really good. Ah, oh, and then I've got, I've got these. I've never seen these before. These are a snack and go chickpea and zesty vinaigrette. I thought for me, while I'm trying to be good um, and lose a bit of weight, I thought I would get try those. I think they were just a dollar each. Yeah, they were one dollar, one dollar nineteen each. So I got two of those. Then I got a milk. It's a three liter light milk. Four forty nine. And then last but not least, I got some roasted and salted cashews. You get five packs in here, five individual packs. And they were $4.49 for five of them. I thought they'd be good for snacking. Cool. Wow, that was quite the shock. I didn't expect to get so much when I went, but then I thought well, I might as well because we're going to eat it. <laughs> you know, you've got to eat. So, yeah. I'm going to make myself one of those shakes. I'm hungry. This is going to be hard. I'm hungry. But anyway, I'll have probably um, the broccolini. 
or a little bit of the pasta bake with some broccoli later and leave the broccolini maybe for another day maybe tomorrow yeah i've promised elliot i'll make these meals for him i'm not very good i'm not very good at cooking really um i don't i'm not very adventurous in the kitchen <laughs> let's put it that way so i've promised him i'd make him some meals that's why i've bought the carrots and the broccoli um capsicum and things like that so i can make i can make some nice meals with that lot anyway i'm gonna go and put this away that's the worst part of shopping isn't it putting it away but um yeah i hope you enjoyed this little midweek what i got from aldi and coles <laughs> and the chemist warehouse as well but um yeah i love you and leave you and i hope i'll see you next time in my next video <laughs> bye guys mm.